if you look at this Jets roster, you know, it's not that bad of a roster at all. I mean, they've got a good, young, fast defense. You know, they've got, obviously, a fucking superstar, potential superstar quarterback. They've got, you know, I, I like Robbie Anderson. I like Jermaine Curse, honestly. I think it's not bad. they got Terrell Pryor now. Maybe he can redeem himself. I mean, and the defense, you know, you added Morris Claiborne and Tremaine Johnson these past few years, and honestly, I mean, that's not a bad secondary at all with, Obviously, you Jamal Adams and Marcus May are fucking... Jamal Adams is a fucking superstar. And Marcus May, I mean, he's a good safety as well. He's young. Same draft. And Tremaine Johnson, Marcus Claiborne, that's not horrible. They've got good young-ish linebackers. They've just got, you know, a decent team everywhere. They don't really suck in any position. They just kind of... Decent, and if Sam Darnold, I mean, if he ends up being a fucking stud, that's a playoff team easily in the AFC. I mean, you beat the fuck out of the Bills. I don't think the Patriots are going to be the same. They they basically have no, they basically have Brady, Gronk, and then, like, McCourty. Like, that's pretty much it now. I mean... Stephon Gilmore is not that fucking good. They lost, obviously, the guy they fucking benched in the Super Bowl. Malcolm Butler's gone, and... I mean, this division is kind of up for grabs. People don't really tend to think that way, but it kind of is. Brady's going to hit that wall eventually, and... You know, my my favorite team, the Dolphins... You know, I don't... I think they're like an 8-8, eight, 8-8 eight, eight eight kind of team. Not really... A you know, maybe make the playoffs, maybe go 6-10. and ten. Like, I could see anything. And the Jets, I mean, I could see all kinds of shit with the Jets. I could see a fucking dumpster fire. I could see, you know, 11-5. and five. Would, Did anyone think the Rams would be that good last, last season? No. They thought they'd fucking suck. Every year, it's the shit happens every year. Last year, only one team in the NFC had made back-to-back playoff appearances. That was Atlanta. And, you know, a lot of people talking about the Bears being the biggest, you know, improvement. I don't fucking see it. I think the Jets are going to be the most improved team. (laughs) You know, especially if Donald wins that starting quarterback job. He, he's supposed to be a superstar. It's not a bad defense at all. That's actually pretty decent defense. Leonard Williams, it's nice. And, you know, Sam Donald's going to make everyone better. And that deep threat, Robbie Anderson's going to be nice. Curse is, a, you know, it's a nice weapon. I don't know. I don't think the O line's anything special, but. You know, you got a young guy running back there. It's not that big of a deal. Got to get an O-line soon, but I think the Jets could sneak into the playoffs this year. I could honestly see them going 2-14, and fucking 14, or I could see them making the playoffs. You know, anything can happen. Superstar potential everywhere. Jamal Adams, Leonard Williams, Sam Darnold. This is... This is a team that's got a lot of fucking potential, and if they put it together this year, I can see them going 10-6 and, and making it into that wild card. 